like you said, your dad wasn't really impressed with the whole basketball thing. And I know most African parents, they don't really care about the sports side. They want you to be in those books. For real. How hard was it for you to just continue the, the, your love for basketball? Yeah. And come home with like your dad, like, so what? <laughs> <laughs> so I probably started playing basketball when I was four. It was my mom who gave me the basketball. Mm. My mom was not an athlete. Mm -hmm. She's a nerdy little kind of quirky little, you know, Jewish girl, like no athleticism, but she had spirit. Mm. She had passion. Mm -hmm. And I think more than anything, she was a crusader for women's rights and women's advancement. And what she saw at the time was she was just trying to give me another option. And I don't even think she would have thought at the time, my mother's name, Patricia Bowles, but she, um, I don't think at the time she knew that basketball was gonna give me a college scholarship. I don't think she knew that it would show me the world. I don't think she knew that it would give me a, a television career or some of the best friends that I know. I think all she really wanted was just to give us a chance to get some life skills, to have us be strong little girls, mm -hmm. to make friends with other people in the community. Literally, there weren't even basketball teams where we were in Queens. My mom had created like flyers on like MS Paint like a little stick figure with hands and like a little ball and like a sign like mothers bring your daughters oh, to wow. Our Lady of the Angeles. And it was like a whole collection of like, just a really ragtag collection of like a bunch of little black girls, a bunch of little Latina girls, a bunch of little Indian girls mm -hmm. and their moms and like a couple of dads. Yeah. And like we were on a regular basement that we turned into a court with tape. Yeah. And that was my mother's spirit. She did that. She drove us all, as I got better, she drove us all through the country to go play in tournaments. And then as I continued to uh, improve, she sent my tapes to Stanford and different places that helped me later get a scholarship. Mm -hmm. So I definitely wanna say it was my mom who gave me the love of the game. Um, and also, while academics was always important to her, my dad was definitely pushing the books. Yeah. And so it was a great combination of the two. Mm -hmm.